Right now at five, preparations are underway for New Year's Eve parties around our area, but every new year comes with a painful reminder for one local firefighter. That Milwaukee fire lieutenant sharing his story about the holiday that still haunts him. Seven years ago, a drunk driver missed him, but hit and killed a single mother. Rebecca Clough joins us in studio with his message for all of us. Rebecca. Katie, people often focus on New Year's Eve as the holiday people drive drunk on, but Lieutenant Michael Bell says he almost died the next day because someone's bad decisions. I thought that that this was it, that this was this was going to be the end. That's what Lieutenant Michael Ball was thinking as he was heading into a shift at the Milwaukee Fire Department on New Year's Day, 2011. He was driving on I-94 when a car was headed the wrong way, straight for him. I hugged the wall to the left uh, as much as I could, uh, kind of half closed my eyes and uh, I braced uh, for the impact. The crash never came. Michael was instead sideswiped. A huge uh, um, wave of, of relief and thankfulness and gratitude. But the person behind him was not spared. Police say 34 year old Corey Damsky was killed on impact. The man driving Leopoldo Salias Gaetan had a blood alcohol count nearly double the legal limit. He was sentenced to 15 years in jail for homicide by intoxicated use of a vehicle. Corey Damsky was a single mother who left behind a little girl. Every January 1st, I think about that again. Does it make you feel like you have a message to give? We want people to rein in the new year and enjoy themselves doing that, but, but to think about um, the night before you go out, think about how you're going to get home. There's so many different options, and there's no excuse um, to be getting behind the wheel if you've had a few to drink. Now, there are a variety of free rides being offered on New Year's Eve, including free bus rides on MCTS. And if you're at a bar, all you have to do is ask your server for a safe ride and you can get a free cab ride home. The Tavern League offers those services in counties around the state.